Hey guys, it's Will. In today's training, I'm going to show you how easy it is to create a subdomain for your domain. And so you can create multiple web pages and have them hidden or show them in the tabs, whatever works for the marketing system that you're using. But it's very easy to create subdomains in GoDaddy. I get this question a lot from people on my team. So I'm just going to go ahead and do one right now and then you guys will see just how easy it is. So um, first of all, what you do is you go to GoDaddy and you log into your account. Um, in any one of, I mean, you're probably going to have end up with a few domains. I'm just going to go into this one. Click on Manage the Domain. It will take you to a page that looks like this. So you scroll down a little bit and what you're looking for is this right here, Total DNS. And at the bottom, there's a link, a clickable link that says Total DNS Control. I'm going to click on that and it sort of takes you into a back office. Um, and then as you'll see, I've already created a bunch of subdomains for my main domain, domain name, which is magneticwealthsystem.com for this particular uh, marketing campaign. So I already happen to know that this is the number that I need to use. And I use Weebly to create my web pages. If you're on my team, then you're using Weebly too. And Weebly will give you this number. But uh, we'll do it backwards now. You'll see that you can get it from Weebly as well. So I am going to take this and copy it. Then you go over here and it, the tab that says add a new record. <clears throat> so you put in the name, uh, no spaces. I'm just going to call this one training example. I'm going to delete it as soon as we get done with this. And then I will paste in the number that I just copied. So there it is and I'm good to go. <clears throat> and you'll see in a minute that GoDaddy will tell me I, I've got it. <clears throat> and so what I have now is a domain that will be training example. See this replaces the www in effect. Your main site is going to be www and any subdomain you use is going to replace that. So this is going to be training example dot magnetic wealth system dot com so you go over to Weebly and say you want to create a new site okay again I'm gonna delete this when we're done I just want to show you how easy this is so okay there's my site choose a website address well I already own my own domain right I just made it training example dot magnetic wealth system dot com continue okay <clears throat> it's done now it sometimes takes GoDaddy they say 24 to 48 hours I've never had to wait that long Okay, so I've just gone in here and typed in this little piece of text. Obviously, this is just an example. Okay, so let's publish it and let's see if it's up yet. Boom, there it is. So that's how fast it is. I've got a website and here's the URL training example at magneticwealthsystem.com. That is how you create a subdomain in GoDaddy using Weebly and you can use this uh, do the same no matter what you use as an interface to create your websites there's going to be a number that they give you and you just punch that right into GoDaddy uh, it's always going to be in the same string three digits two digits three digits two digits and you can use that same one over and over so I hope this was able to give you some value in this video and I look forward to connecting with you in the next one